Hi and welcome to Shop RJ Pacific Great Deals on eBay. Today I want to do a brief intro demo on this item I picked up the other day. And matter of fact, it's on eBay. So let me just close this window out over here and I'll show you what I'm talking about. That's right here. This is the Sony Dream Machine. The model is RCF CD855V. And for those who are new to my YouTube channel, I just want to say welcome and thank you for stopping by. Uh, just a little brief intro on myself. How I started my YouTube channel was doing by doing videos like this here. Some people like them, they got a takeaway from them. And to this very day, I still get people inquiring about certain things on uh, the items I'd sold in the past. <laughs> so uh, I figured, let me let me try doing another video like this here. So it's, I'm going to try to keep it as short as possible. And for those who are uh, following me on this YouTube channel or, or long-time subscribers, um, I don't know if it's just people left comments that are just passed by, you know, passerbys that just hit my YouTube channel, left, you know, uh, very, you know, brief comments, uh, stating, uh, stating, I should say, that, you know, you talk about the items, but you don't get into full detail with it. Folks, I don't have the time to read everything verbatim about this particular item or any of the items I sell. Um, because I had people on there, I, I would get comments every now and then where people would make these derogative remarks saying, you know, you, you do a video and you don't get the whole, you don't do the whole thing, explain it from point A to point B. The whole premise behind these videos, folks, just to let you guys know out there, it is to show the potential eBay buyer that the item works. And a lot of you may be wondering, well, why would you do a video showing you that an item works well for the simple reason is there have been buyers that have purchased items from me in the past i've been on ebay for 22 years and they they claim that the item is defective or it doesn't work so you as either a seasoned seller or you're thinking about selling on ebay you are going to have these type of situations arise sometime in your ebay future <laughs> seriously um <clears throat> i can tell you i've been through a lot with this here i don't get many returns but I have had in the past where people would say, you know, uh, you know, the item is defective, it's not working. And I always think by having a video, it's, it's proof enough to show eBay that the buyer uh, is, you know, just throwing things out there and uh, it's not true. So I like to create videos on occasion like this here. And if you are new to this YouTube channel, I probably will be doing it on occasion. I have another channel where I usually do it, but this is my main channel. This is the one I want to grow. And this is the one I want to share information with you guys out there. Okay. So I hope you'll come back from time to time. I hope you'll hit, hope you'll hit that subscribe button because I also do the reseller news and let's talk eBay. And I'm also a vlogger, so I like to share tips and tricks on how I create my videos, how I take my photos, you know, and so on and so forth, okay? Um, I try to keep this a well-rounded uh, YouTube channel, so uh, hopefully you won't be bored when you keep seeing my videos, okay? But anyway, without further ado, let me just close this out here really quick, this photo, and I want to show you what I got over here. I think, I think it's a uh, Cam 4. Here you can see with this particular model, I got, a, I got an extension cord right next to my desk over here, and I got the AC adapter. One thing about these Sonys, I'm a Sony guy by the way, people are wondering, I love Sonys. Um, the, the AC power adapter is heavy. I mean, can you see this guys? Look at this thing. This thing is heavy. Look at this. It's, it's got weight to it. It must, I don't know how much it weighs, but it's probably, I would say if I had to take a guess, I'd probably say it's about a pound. Let's see for curiosity. I got a scale over here, a little postage scale. Let's just see what this guy weighs. I'm curious. Okay, let's power it on, and we'll do the whole feature. And I'll show you guys. Yeah, I was right. Yeah, we'll take it off here. And this is what it is. Oops. There it is. One pound, one ounce. See that? Yep. That's how heavy this little guy is. <laughs> so... Uh, it does have some weight to it. I don't know. They always do that. And the other thing I want to share with you guys when it comes to these these type of, uh, what do you call it there, uh, digital clocks. You're going to find a little thin wire like this. Here, can you see it? This little thin wire, I got it wrapped up right now. As a matter of fact, I should take the uh, twisty off here. Um, this little thing, believe it or not, people wondered like that. What is that little wire for? I had that in my other, because uh, I sell Sony's, you know, other Sony uh, digital clock radios. And people would ask, what is this for? And I tell them ex exactly what I just said to you guys. This here, this little wire, is the antenna, believe it or not. And it's attached to the system itself, right here you can see it, along with the AC adapter, of course. The AC adapter and these things do not unplug. 
they're fixed in. In other words, they're you know mounted inside. You can't. It's not something you could pull out a plug. What's nice about this particular unit here? It's got a headphone jack. And if you guys are interested in this unit. I have Sony headphones that would plug into here as well, but I don't know if you guys would like to listen to it like that. But it is a good unit. It works really good. I have a disc over here. The uh, Mozart here. Was it Mozart? Night Music. I got this here. So we're going to put that in a little bit. Now, I want to give you just a little point to hear, folks, when it comes to uh, creating, uh, or I should say, you know, getting ready to do your this, you know, uh, eBay ad. It's always good to at least print out the instructions and I can't stress that enough folks because for the simple reason is I have sold these type of items in the past and to be honest with you I would get messages even today that how do you set the timer how do you set the dimmer light and so on and so forth I printed out a two pager like that you can see for this for this um, what do you call it, for this unit right here you can see it right there and I'm going to whoever buys this on any electronic things I sell I will print out an instruction booklet or uh, a manual whatever possible if it's too big of a manual like some manuals are like about a hundred pages or so um, I won't print that stuff like that a 32 page I wouldn't mind doing because like I said I do two-sided on it there uh, that I don't mind but you're probably wondering what's in this folder here this folder here has other uh, what do you call it there? Uh, information, quick guides or whatever. This one here is for the. Uh, I'm selling a nice HP monitor. If you look on eBay, you'll see this one here. Really nice monitor. It's it. Uh, this thing rises. The monitor goes up and down. It slides up and down. Really nice, pretty clean unit. Test it out. It works. It's all ready for shipping. If you're interested in that, check out my listings. Maybe at the end of the video, I will uh, post that in there and stuff like that. I'll show you some of the items I have listed on eBay in case you never checked out my eBay listings. Let's put this to the side over here. All right. I'm not going to use the instruction booklet right now to show you how to. I'm not going to get too much into it. Read it unless I need to. But let's get over here and look at some of the function buttons here. Okay. I got to look at the side here. Uh, let me move this way here. And I have to look at it where this I could see it myself. Uh, here we got some buttons over here. We got um, what do you call? It? We got the CD radio buzzer. I'll, I'll place the camera there and I'll show you in a little bit. This is the um, preset tuning uh, key right here button. You got uh, five presets. This is the one that opens it up. It's got a nice little open there. It opens up like a gliding thing there. I like it. Okay, on that side and basically. This one here on this side has CD, radio, uh, buzzer, and that's got alarm B, and this one here is alarm A. So you got two settings. You got one that says nap, sleep, CD, fast forward. I guess you want to hit the play button, radio, uh, radio on, and here's the band button. Right, you click that on, you get uh, AM and FM, whatever. Now this thing, according to that thing here, it says over here TV weather. Okay, so it's got TV and weather. I guess you can listen to the station, the weather stations, and the TV. Here's your tuna button over here, and here's the alarm setting. Now, I see again when I sell this item, I'm going to sell with the instructions. So if you're one of the lucky people who do, you know, want to buy this after you see this video, it has been listed today. Today is uh, April 27, 2022. Uh, I'm going to leave this video up even after this thing sells, and the reason why I'm going to do it is just to, you know, throw it out there. Some people may want to. You know check it out whatever like you know they may because the, the title is going to be checking out uh you know doing a demo video or intro video on this particular model that'll be the title over here on this thing here so i probably will be leaving it up uh even after this item sells um here we have over here another button here uh i can't read this here right now it's a little dark in this room here believe it or not this is the volume button right here can you see this is the volume button high and low and this one here is the mode this is the mode button right here can you see that we can see that okay I'm working off on the this camera this is my iPhone 5s right here that I'm working with here showing you the video and here in the back here you got the settings. you got the bright settings button here and you got the clock I think this is the one you can make it darker or lighter or whatever oh no right over here I'm sorry and this one here gets how to set the clock on here all right, so listen, I'm not going to get too much into this, like I said, folks. It's basically, and I know I'm going to get comments on this, it's basically just to show the protect, you know, the potential eBay buyer that this item is working, you know. So uh, that's why I'm doing this video. A lot of people may bake the difference, say you really, if you're going to do it, 
get into it wholeheartedly and you know go through the whole you know whole verbatim about how to set it and so on and so forth. I'm going to leave that to the buyer to do it. That's why I printed out these instructions here. I figure this way here it'll help them out. Okay, when a person gets it, they'll have something to refer, you know, reference. Okay, um, and that's it. It's only a two pager. Like I said, it's only a two pager, and it stays in that file until the item's sold, and then I will put it in another piece of in a plastic jacket. And, uh, you know, then the uh, person who has it, they'll have at least they have instructions with it. And if you're a seller on eBay, it only takes, what, so many minutes to do that there, to print it out. You might as well, you know. Let's go over here to this camera here. All right, let's move it to this one here. If I can get this one to work. Here we go. Yeah. Um, this this yeah, and it is it is a nice unit though it is really nice I tested it out already and it, it works really good so we're gonna just do a little demo on it I have a cord extension cord over here I keep by the, not all the time by the way but we're gonna plug it in okay there we go like this all right let's move this back here I'll leave it over here okay let's go back to that cam four again all right as you can see right now it's blinking. Um, you know something, folks? It's pretty self-explanatory, to be honest with you. But like I said again, um, I, if I if if you're you, if you're new to eBay, you think you're selling on eBay or whatever, or you are a seasoned seller, print out the instructions. Seriously, help the buyer out. Um, you know, they like it. And and what are you gonna? You know, some people may say, yeah, but you're wasting money on ink and toner. I don't worry about that, folks. What I want, my goal is to have a happy buyer, <laughs> and I've been doing that. I, this ain't the first time. This is a whole folder. This is a whole uh, envelope thing here, full of different ones that I'm selling. Okay, not just not just that. These are these are all printed out. These are all for items I'm selling. You can see it's pretty thick. Okay, and I will I will be sending those with the items I sell. All right, enough talking. Let's open this bad boy up. I'm just gonna play it, you know, some music, whatever, and then uh, that'll be it. Okay. So let's put this in. We're going to put in Mozart. Yeah, Mozart. Mozart's Night Music. Okay. Like I said again, folks, this is just for demo purposes to show the potential buyer this item works. Okay. Now, you're going to give me a little chance here because I don't remember how <laughs> I got it to go. Uh, I know you're probably saying you're contradicting yourself. You said it's easy to. No, it is. I mean, I, I mean, I could, pra I could probably, no doubt, set this thing without the instructions. All right. So let's go over here to... Uh, CD here. Let's see here. We want to get to the one that says CD. It's over here. There it is. Okay. There's a CD one there. And you can see it's spinning. Let's see if we can get on here. Once. It works. It really is nice. It does play nice. It gets a lot louder than that, too. I think it only goes up to... What is it? 35? It goes up to 50. Right, we're not going to keep it too loud. Okay. And then, again, if you want to switch it over, you would hit this button here. Let's lower this down a little here. This is the one, I believe, right here. CD one that, that switches the channel. It should change it, I think. Or oh, wait, hold on for a second here. I'm trying to see how it changes again here. Like I said, folks, this ain't mine, so you gotta bear with me on this here. Uh, let's see here. Nap, sleep. Oh, that's the one just to picks up on here. The radio. We don't want to do it just yet. I'm trying to find a way how to change it here. That's, these are the presets here, by the way. Right here, these buttons are the presets. But you're probably wondering, can you change it? Yes, you can change it. I just want to see something here. It ain't that one that changes it. Sleep, CD. There is a way to change it. I did it earlier. <laughs> I don't remember, but I know I did it earlier here. Okay. Well, it ain't that one there, and it can't be this one. Oh, it's this guy. Sorry guys. You know sometimes these things throw you off. Um, the changing you would think would be on this. It is on this side here. I thought it was on that side where the presets are. But it, all the changing is done through here. You can see the numbers change up here. See it here, right there. Okay. And then you know it's got some nice songs in here. I got this as a, a gift. My daughter knows I like classical music. So you can see it here. Let's see. If we get this to play. Hit this button here. 
when you're changing it you gotta hit this button here I don't know if you can see it says CD that's the one you gotta hit so you can move it like this but hit that button there too this one here to make it play I believe that's the way it's working like that. Plays really nice, isn't it? It's, it really is a nice unit. You know, I've, I I would like to keep these things myself, but I already got one. I not this particular model, but I got another Sony one. But anyway, um, okay, enough with that. There, let's go to the radio. Now I'm going to switch the band over here, well, to, to the different function. Here. Let's go to the radio here. Should get this right over here. Oh wait, it's this one here. I think. Let's stop. Let's stop this first. Let's stop this. And bear with me for one second, guys. Let's take this out of here. Put this back in this jacket here. The case. Okay, let's close it up. This is your snooze button, by the way, too. You hit that there. Well, if you give you one of those people that get up in the morning and hit the snooze, you know. All right, now the radio. Um, it's supposed to be like this here. Sleep. Oh, there it is. Here's the radio right here. It's the radio one right here. Okay. FM, you see it, see it moving around? That's the weather. AM, FM1, FM2, and that's the TV channels. Okay. Um, let's just try AM. I don't want to play music because then I'll get a, I'll get a, a strike on here. So let's, let's see if we can get a channel to come in here. A channel I know. So it sounds like this here. And I guess the Mets are playing baseball today. I don't know. You got that. And then, of course, if you want to change the band, you would do that there. Let's see. Was it right over here? I guess the AM. Is this the one? No, we'll see it right here. That's it there. And that's AM. I mean FM. Let's see what they got on FM here. If I can get a channel to come in. I'm not going to go through the weather channel and stuff like that there. I'm just trying to get a channel that I know of. Like I said, I don't want to play play too much music or anything like that because then I'll get a copyright strike. That's, that's yeah. broken. And, and that's it. Like, there's no way. So, and God said, let me show you the okay. work that I can do through one All right. song. So anyway, that's what we got going. I'm going to lower this down here. All right. So let me just lower this down here, guys. Let's go back over here to this regular camera number one here oh, always delays that there yeah so that's what I got going on right now folks um, I have like I said again I haven't done one of these videos in a long time but if you are interested in this or any other ones I have any other uh, I do have I think I have other I think I have a Sony, another Sony dream machine not that particular model all right but um, if you are interested in this one here it's gonna be on eBay like I said I listed it today so if you want to check it out fine it does have a little minor scuff mark on it let's go back over here again to this one here oh let me close this out here I can't get this it won't my camera won't switch over when it's got that like that um let me show you what I'm talking about it's right over here I don't know if you guys could see it it's got little little marks over here scuff marks or whatever so can you see that guys I don't know if you can see that there there you go it's a little better yeah it's got that. Uh, however, though, the screens, you know, whatever the uh, casing for the speakers, this is nice. You're very, I was pretty lucky because usually when these things are in uh, thrift stores or yard sales, they usually got to be careful that they're not dented, you know. Um, but however, people will buy them, you know, they will still buy the unit. Some people, that doesn't bother them, you know what I'm saying? But uh, if you guys, like I said again, are interested in here, it will be on eBay. That's all I have for you right now, guys. Until next time, I'm Rich Bassini. For shop RJ Pacini for great deals on eBay. And as I always like to close my videos when it comes to doing the eBay segments, if you are thinking about selling on eBay or you are a seller on eBay, I am wishing you all the best in sales. Till next time, bye bye for now.